All right, if your thinkorswim's been acting a little sluggish lately, uh, I'm going to show you two things you can do rather quickly to uh, attempt to troubleshoot the issue and see if you can get things uh, sped back up again. So uh, before you do either of these, go into your setup, application settings, come down here to system, and check to make sure that you know your quote speed is, is where you want it and it's not delayed. Um, the other thing is check to make sure that you're running real-time data. So there's actually not an issue with your data feed. Um, and then the thing inside the app that you can do is click on help and you want to be on system. It may be on contact us or disclosures, but you want to be on system. Come over here and click collect garbage. And you'll see the, the used memory drops. Um, and then it'll start picking back up and you can do it again and again and again but for me whenever I opened it up this morning um, I couldn't get any charts to load but the data was coming through on the level twos so I just decided well I'll go in here and collect garbage and see what happens I came in here collect garbage and then all of a sudden my chart started showing up again so the other thing is uh, you have to do it on your login so when you log in what you're gonna want to do is once this little dialog opens up, you're going to click this gear icon and check your memory usage, your minimum to your max. I have mine set all the way down here because I'm running, I have 128 gigs of RAM. So allowing this thing to eat up 65 gigs of RAM is not a problem for me. But be sure you set it within your system's limits and uh, you don't want to set it too high or else your, your whole system will start to bog down. So those are two little quick fixes you can do that might help you get your thinkorswim uh, out of being sluggish again.